Look, y'all. Focus it out. Seven days a week. Look at the time. 111, 122. And this is Nipsey. <gasps> He's here. You should follow suit and just get to the bed. People gonna talk either good or is bad. I see people gonna talk either good or is bad. What do you wanna be when you grow up? Uh, a firefighter. A firefighter? Why do you wanna be a firefighter? Because I wanna put out fires and rescue kitties and, 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 and help people get better. That's good. Wait. Show them what we can do. It's not follow the rules game. You have to follow the rules. You have to do whatever they say in motion. So to follow the rules game, the rules are Malia's rules? Yes, you have to follow my rules, you know? <laughs> so about the Kikina, she loves playing fire, ice, power with me. How we play fire, let's show them how to play fire night. <laughs> Tornado! <laughs> Y'all gotta spin around, she tornadoed you. Spin around. She loves talking to the grown-ups. She I do. loves talking to me, and she loves telling people what to do. No, you love telling people what to do. Okay, that was what I was playing. Can I talk to Daddy? Okay. Daddy. She got to talk to her daddy real quick. Yeah. Daddy? Yes, ma'am. Can we, can we have a little fun time? We just were doing your thing. <laughs> <laughs> she told you. Oh, man. And I love laughing at her making jokes. You do? Yeah. Is Auntie Kina funny? And I think Kina acts so weird. I don't know what's wrong with her. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with Kina. We better freak it out. This is the Empress Kina show. Check it out, everybody. Okay, I never told y'all this, but I have a twin brother. Show yourself. I'm here, and I'm hungry. I real talk. My twin brother, but he older than me. My baby look like you. No, everybody looked at Malia like she could be your daughter. I'm like, she I'm is. Telling you. I believe she was supposed to be my daughter, but she was meant to be born now and you was more ready Because one time I had a dream that I had a baby and I had to give it to you And I like cried over the like I was so sad I had to get a baby to you though because I couldn't take care of it And I remember you told me that story. I said, huh? And now it makes sense what you just said I said, you know what? Because when you dream it, you in the spiritual realm it, you said it, man. So you don't know. God told you something, but it's not pretty. The, it's not exactly the same way you see it, but it's metaphorically, spiritually describing something that's going on or about to happen. Exactly. Sometimes I wake up so exhausted because I know in my dreams I didn't took off and went astral projected somewhere. Like I was not here. I believe it. Cause you hear stories about people having they call it a out of body experience. Like you, cause in life you gonna hit your your time when you when you hurt. It. But you gotta get up again. You say you fall six times, get up seven, right? Well, that number continues. It'll never stop. The concept is you fall, get up fast. Like, I never give up. I'm gonna keep fighting to the end. But in life, it's a marathon, right, Nip? Yes. Boy, now tell you, man, this spirit is traveling, man. And honestly, I'm not man. saying that, like, oh, I'm happy he's gone. I'm not happy because the way his life was ended was tragic. When I saw Lauren London, it just took so much out of my soul. But he did not die in vain. But that's what music does, because music, they say, is a key to the soul. How God operates, God is to the sounds. So that's why your words are very powerful. The more the more words you put out there as positive, it's a beautiful sound in God's ears. And that's what, in God's eyes, because he hears. That's why his guidance is never give up. It's a grind, it's a marathon. That's key to life. A marathon, at the end of the day, you have to patiently utilize all your energy to extend it out to get to the end of the marathon. But there's still a winner. You have to still think about, I gotta get here at a certain point. So I mean, I gotta grind even harder every day. Sometimes you can get discouraged because things that you want aren't coming fast enough for you because you put in the effort and work, but you're not getting any benefits from it though. All that work that you put in, eventually it'll come back to you. When I went to Wisconsin Dale, it was this, this slide. It's huge. I'm talking about you gotta walk up at least 16 flights. And when you get to the top, it's a straight shot down. It's a, it's a, a, a slide? A slide. Ooh. Straight body. And it's called the point of no return. Let me, cause I know it just hit you, but let me tell you how they set it up though. They set you up so cold. It's little signs at each, each level. So the first sign is like, you thinking it's sweet type shit. You like, yeah, I got it. It's not that bad. I mean, it's not that far up. As you get higher and higher, 
the car's getting slicker and slicker. They like, now you starting to look down. Now you getting a little nervous. So now they in your head. So you are reading it. Now you could have stopped reading it, but you're going to keep reading. And they, they all in your head all the way up. And then at the last time when you like reach the top and you see the bottom of the slide, now you have the point of no return. Because you're not going to walk all the way back down. But you wasted all your effort to get up there. It's only one way down. Like, ooh, did I make the give decision to get up here? Ooh, this, this, you, I don't know, ooh. Because it's a mind it's thing. A mind. Everything back to the mind. At that point, I mean, hey, come to this. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're here now. <laughs> it all starts off as just a seed, mm -hmm. and I think when people don't see the flower blossom, they they don't think the spring is coming. But they not know, noticing the little stems that's popping up and sprouting out. It's an evolution. Malia, hold this. What is this? Crystals. Do you know that that's a power surge? Malia? Yes? How do you know crystals are supposed to be charged? They need to get charged so they can shine bright. Yeah, like so, the rainbow. After a rain comes, um, a, a, the sunlight hits the drop and that's how you make a rainbow. Who told you that? Nobody. <laughs> I just need my tablet.